Oh, Marissa's in trouble. Marissa's in oh, trouble. Breathe. breathe. They are struggling to breathe. They're struggling to breathe, though. Don't panic. Three, two, one, go. And they're off. They're into the first room. They're trying to split up, but they just realized that they're tough to the rim. Get it, you got it, got it, get it. Oh my God. Definitely disgusting, whatever is in there. It yeah. was cold, it smelled bad. I feel like something died. Got it. Get to me, get to me. Is that the key to the handcuff, or is that one of the three keys they'll need to get to the next room? Our strategy is me looking through like the intestines and stuff. Got it. They found the second key. While she was trying to unlock the handcuffs, but it was definitely hard. Dracula's original? You better stop talking before yeah. I get violent. Oh my god, please. Gloria, oh my gosh. Gloria! Oh my god. The second they closed the coffin door on me, I couldn't think, couldn't breathe. Being in a closed space, darkness was very, very, very overwhelming. Okay, this is so much tighter than I thought it was gonna be. <sighs> Bring on the dirt! Underground. Gloria, please hurry up. Some people think that they'd be fine in a closed space, but when you're actually in it, it's a completely different story. I wouldn't wish it upon my worst enemy. Uh oh. All right, we got one box. We got for one part of the show. I'm sending you the second code, Gloria. Got it, got it. All right, we got another box open. That's two boxes. Okay, got the last code, girl. Gloria! All right, we got the last box. Get that shovel together and dig your friend out. Here we go. Coming, Christina. Yes, Gloria. Please start shoveling. Christina, I'm right here, girl. $50,000 is down there. You're digging for treasure right now. Uh, I can't breathe, Gloria. You, know, you can go three minutes without air before the brain shuts off. I definitely got really nervous. She was struggling with the dirt a lot. Talk to me, Gloria! Christina! I swear to God! I started getting really frustrated with Christina because I'm losing my breath as well, and I'm trying so hard, you know, got scratched up everything to get her out. OK, can you open? Can you open? No! But, you know, I definitely understand where she's coming from, being buried alive. You know, you're not going to be super reasonable with the person who's in charge of getting you out safely. Bitch, I'm breaking my back! Gloria, are you taking me? Bitch, no! <laughs> oh I am trying to get you to Gloria! Go, go, go! Go, go, go! Let's go, Christina! It's OK. It's OK. I'm going to kill you. <laughs> oh, it's like a zombie Christina back from the dead. 
I don't know how you expected me to open this with all this freaking that was dirt. So oh. That was definitely the worst thing that could have ever been done to me. Three, two, one, go! Someone looks real worried right now. All right, you better hurry up, Sophia. Save your girl. Go save her. You got the first key. She's trying the first one. First one doesn't work. She's trying the second key. Second key doesn't work. Put that thing in there. She's going for the third. Third key, trying it out. Oh, it works! Oh, she got the flag! Time! Three, two, one. <laughs> Go! Don't let it get in your mouth! They lay eggs in your ear? Oh, she's spitting already. Feeling the flies buzz around in my mouth while I'm trying to chew was probably the worst part of it all. In my face, and my nose, the smell was unbearable. I freaked out. Oh! Oh! Get it, get it, get it. Devin is two marshmallows down. And Tiana ate one, so five more to go. It was like an army of insects trying to attack me, buzzing around my ear, trying to get into my nose. Oh, it's in your hair. She's got a marshmallow stuck in her hair. Eat it, girl, eat it, eat it. Girl. Eat it, girl. Eat it, please. Oh, I can't do it. <laughs> Tiana is not having any party whatsoever. She was freaking out for sure because that was one of her worst fears. She wasn't carrying her weight at all. Oh, one more, one more, one more. Oh, Tiana is paralyzed with fear. But there's still one marshmallow left. It's all up to death. Oh, hurry, 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 hurry. <laughs> Look, if this don't bring them closer, I don't know what will. <gasps> I feel her pain. Yeah, me too. You can't predict how you're going to feel when you have to face something that is literally your worst nightmare. I am anxious and stressed. As I'm pulling myself in this box, I am just thinking that I'm going to die. Hey, you guys got this. Let's go. Come on, guys. Come on, B. You got it. Trust me. Trust me. You can do it. Okay. You got it. No, I'm not. I want to be anywhere else but here. I hate this. Start the truck. Time will start when the cement hits the box. Here comes the cement. They are getting those knocks. Go, go, go. They're going fast as they can. Right when that cement hit, it was harder than I thought it would be, like heavier. You have a mentality that this is hardening it second by second. Ow! I need the rope, I need the rope. Our strategy was get to whatever knot that we saw the end of right away, and then keep that end of the knot going in between our hands, never dropping that into the cement. What are you trying to give me? What are you trying to All I could focus on was I gotta get out of here, and I could not think about the knot. Everything that I needed to know just immediately evaporated from my mind. Let's go, you can do this. <laughs> That feels Watching the drowning in cement. I want no part of this. Remember, once they get it untangled, they can pull the rope and it'll stop the cement. Come on, B. It was really heavy and the rate. The flow. I'm gonna either have to fully submerge under the cement or I'm gonna have to like be crushed against these bars. You got this, B. Come on, B. There you go, B. You got it. 
I'm done. I'm done. All you gotta get the oh, she quit. Get her out of there. Are you ready? Yes, yes. ready. Let's go. All right, on my go. Three, two, one, go. Y'all look extra thirsty right now. Extra thirsty. Breathe. 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 A big part of our strategy was to make sure that we don't let the water get too far up. That way we don't accidentally choke on the water and we can take a big enough breath to hold our breath underwater longer. Now, Kale, how you feeling right now? This is pressure right here, right? Let's hope this man relives yeah. his traumatic experience. I feel like I'm waiting for the results of a pregnancy test. You know what I'm saying? All right, Jerry, this is your worst nightmare. This is where you face your fear. You got this, guys. Oh, damn, there goes your phone. Phone is gone. Hold on. Just relax, guys. 2.30. Think about the money. Oh, yeah. No, don't think about the money. Think about the water. Think about your life. You got this, guy. Your worst fear is about to happen. The water's about to overtake you. Just relax, guys. Hey, don't call. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. There's no challenge issue. No challenge issue. You can do it. Three minutes. Just pull it. Oh, oh Jerry, come on, buddy. Oh, oh, he, oh, he, he gotta go. There it is, there it is. Pull it. Stay calm. Now, you sure he's still in there? Oh, oh. <laughs> Jerry, you did that. You faced your fear, man. You did great. I'm so proud of you. Start the water. Nice and cold. You're feeling like you're beginning to drown. Three, two, one, go! Whoa, they on the move, they on the move. I'm scared of drowning. I'm scared of being stuck and unable to move. All of a sudden, I can't think. I saw her hustling. I saw her moving things, and that shocked me back into reality. Like, I need to get things out of the way. Aubrey is all twisted. She might get stuck. Time. That challenge was honestly a double whammy for me because I'm scared of enclosed spaces, and I'm scared of drowning, and it was a little bit of both. I can't believe I'm going to have to be chained up while seeing my brother suffocating. I hope he doesn't freak out. He's a, he's a little bitch when it comes to tight places, so don't be a bitch, dude. $50,000 on the line. Look out the air. Carlos, how you doing? You, you ready? Let's do this. He said, let's Woo! do this. All right, let's go. Ruah. I love you, Mom. Three, two. One, go! Please do it, dude. It's really hard to breathe. Ugh. Dude, I can't even move. I'm losing feeling in my legs, Max. Max and Carlos are freaking out. Please, hurry up. I think Max and Carlos may be going home. Find the keys, Max, bro. I, I can't find the keys, dude. They scooted it down That's when he slid me in there. My life is at stake, you idiot. Just kidding, I love you. No, just find the keys. Uh, one lock down! You got one lock? He's got the first lock. He got one lock. All right, Max. One minute, 30 seconds is gone. Oh. Get you out, brother. I play around with latex with my girlfriend. We're not like this. Please. Hurry Second up. lock down. Max. Second lock. All right, all right. Second lock. There it is, there it is. Randy, what are you over there clapping for? Yeah. What's going on? Put that clap down. He's working on the last lock. You keep missing the key, Max. You keep missing the key. Wrong key. For $50,000. This is like my worst fear, and like, I'm just thinking about the 50,000, because that's really important to us, because my mom always worked, you know, three jobs. It would be so nice to just show our appreciation for her. So, Carlos, I know this is your biggest fear, but I got you. I got you. Nightmare. I got you. Nightmare, dude. All you need is one more key. I'm losing air, honestly. Carlos, I got you. For $50,000, hurry up, dude. Oh, hey. All right, OK, OK, OK. All right, here we go. Final fear, $50,000. Three, two, one, go! There it goes. Look 
Mackenzie's at the bottom and Marissa has the top. They started with breathing. They did it a little different than you guys. Started out with breathing. It seems like Mackenzie's the one that's struggling. Marissa's the one getting the wing nut. The ex-Marine is the one that's struggling right now. Uh-oh. Hold on, Marissa's in trouble. Marissa's in oh, trouble. Breathe. breathe. They are struggling to breathe. They're struggling to breathe, though. Don't panic. Mackenzie, you good? Mackenzie's hurt. He's hurt. Mackenzie just looks panicked. I don't know what the hell is going on. Now she's taking after her brother. She finally stepped up to the plate. She's, she's crazier than her brother right now. Kenzie got a second win. He's looking determined. Another wing nut. He's got three wing nuts so far. It's kind of stressful. Looks like they're getting in a rhythm. They're getting in a rhythm. Oh, that's two more wing nuts. It's out. They got it. Uh-oh. Marissa's going the wrong way. You need to breathe. Pull the flag. Come on, come on. My biggest fears are definitely eating anything that's alive. Having it, like, squirm inside my mouth. That sounds really gross. Put the vinegaroon in your mouth. Oh, my god. Ew. This is fear factor. This is what oh. we do. Come on, Andrea. You got this. There you go. It was absolutely horrible. It was moving around. It just tasted disgusting. I mean, that's going to be in my, my nightmares for a while. <laughs> that was gross. You guys ready? Three, two, one. Go! Uh-oh. He's going for the habanero. Oh, Hold it down there. Get it all in there, all in there, all in there for me. Straight for the ghost pepper. The spices didn't kick in on the first one, but then the ghost pepper. It tastes like Jean-Claude Van Damme punched me in my throat. Good, it's cool, it's cool. That's about halfway like full. You, baby. Hey, come on. Another ghost pepper. Oh, how hot is it? Oh my God. Keep dancing, B. Disgusting. Up the up. Ghost pepper. The ghost pepper like kicked in. Tastes like 7,000 spices over the border in my mouth. Pick it up faster, Stop. faster. OK, hit the line. Right. Quinlan, start drinking. Oh, he picked all really, really hot peppers. Come on, baby. So this is going to hurt. Do you feel the throw up coming up? As soon as it got in my throat, I felt that something just grabbed me. I can't let him down, but my body isn't going to agree with what's going on. Let's go. All right, switch, switch. Come on, baby. That's a hot sauce mustache right there. I see it. Ew, don't throw up. Oh, don't throw up. Oh, Ooh. God. Brendan and Quinlan, they talk a lot of they And do. I just, oh, I just want to shut them up. Ooh. Hey, come on. It's hard to watch. Hurry up. You're moving slower because you got this fire in your mouth. And I had to stay focused and listen to my brother. This could be it. Still need more. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Having to go back for an extra shot, I really was about to die. Quinlan picked the less hot pepper. That means his mouth must still be burning. Go! Oh, oh, don't throw oh, don't you feel like you want to He's drinking it. He's going for it. Oh, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I can feel me about to throw up back into my cup, but I actually held my throw up in and I drank through it. Let's see the mouth. Time. Oh, oh. Nato. Fermented soybean. Oh. Tell me that came back out. That is only the first one. Hey. In order to move on, they have to eat three items faster than Tam and Jonathan did. The thought process was swallow everything whole. Don't bite it. Don't let it linger in your teeth. Eat slow so it don't stick to your tongue and make you throw up. But once they come back up and you swallow them again, it was nice and lubricated. You got it, babe. Go. Eat it. I'm waiting for you. You can't keep it down, though. Let it come up. Let it. You got it. There it is. There it is. Go. Go. They hoping for the cupcake. No. No. 100-year-old egg. Can't do it. Can't do it. Oh, you ain't the only one. Tam is gritting. She, she wants them to throw up. They gotta come out. Let it come out. 
Let it come out. Let it come out. Every time that we felt like they were going to beat us, we would trash talk. It was all mental. Oh, Your body off. wants to get rid of that. Five minutes. When I'm eating, I started sweating. I was putting in the work. You got it. Using every muscle in my body, just keep the food down. Keep the food down. Throw up! You're good. You're good. You got to go. Habanero, please. Habanero. Habanero, please. <laughs> She's begging for the habanero. Where is this head? Cheese. Oh, cheese. 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 But not any cheese. That is the stinkiest cheese on earth. Oh, my oh, God. That smell. That smell. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> I was gagging all over the place, but I was just like, just get it done, get it done, get it done, get it done. Are you swallowing? <laughs> Six minutes. Man, suck all them fingers. Oh, oh, oh. Savor it. Savor it. No. Ooh. Oh, hey. no. Come on. Keep it down. Keep it down. No, no. Where are we at with it? Oh. Good now. Are you guys ready? So ready. All right. Three, two, one, go. Someone's aggressive. Oh, money man. Okay, okay. There you go. Bam. All right. The only thing on my mind was getting it done as fast as possible and not even thinking about what was in my mouth. Oh. Huh? She does not look happy right now with that snake in her mouth. Oh. Wrong. They got the code wrong. Money back, so let's get it. All you can do is be happy for somebody's demise. At the end of the day, you trying to win the $50,000. Second attempt to get the first code right. Mm -hmm. They got it right. <laughs> Two minutes. Oh, that's an active one. Good God. Mm. He looked like he liked oh, that. All right, go on the second code. Don't say anything. Don't say anything. Come on now, talk it out. You guys can do it. Nobody learns phone numbers anymore, so of course this is difficult. Seven one four. No. They got it. They got the second one. Three minutes. Uh oh. Right when I grabbed the scorpion, it hooked onto my mouth. Go. And I was trying to like shove it in. So the scorpion bit me. Two scorpions, one code left. One thousand dollars. This is it. This is it. They got it right. God. When I was laying in that tub with hundreds of rats crawling all over me, I felt every single foot of all those rats all over my body. Oh my God! Is that my ear? I can feel the feet. I'm ready. Three, two, one, go. Let's go, Aisha. You got this. Oh man. Got to get the cheese. Oh my God! Fighting a rat for cheese. Go back. Kissing me. They bite. I didn't expect things to bite. Oh my God. There you go, you got one. Don't be scared, you got it. There you go, there's two. It smells like <laughs> in here. <laughs> when I saw Aisha and the tub of rats, I actually was scared. We both have a fear of rats, but like, we're never not gonna not try something. Oh my god. There you go, that's three. Get me out of here, please. Oh. There you go. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, it's like a, it's hard enough trying to find a cheese and then little ass just comes and takes it away. There you go. One more. Go steal your cheese back. Ah. Woo! Hurry up, Tracy. Come on, dump those leeches on him. <laughs> there you go, mom. There you go. When they attached, it was a little bite, but uh, it was mostly the sliminess and the cold water affecting my mentality. Torture. I know it's hard, Aaron. I know you're shaking, but 50,000 is on the line. All right, let's see how many stick. Tracy and Aaron, they consistently surprise us. They overcoming some things that I wouldn't think they would. So I'm nervous. Same way I thought. Stay on balance. I knew they was going to get in the cleavage. My boobs are pretty big, so I thought that would be an advantage for us. Hey, Limbo. There's one that is making a home right ow, now. Ow. Ooh. That's it. All right. Chug a lug, chug a lug. Don't swallow one of those things. Please don't do that. Oh, it's going to my lungs. Man, it sounds, it looks like Aaron's been to a party before. Go, 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 go. Time. Grab those cans and open them. It's going to be a challenge for us, but nothing's going to stop us. Yeah. All right, Joe, you have liver pate. Smells good. Ugh. Beef liquid extract. That don't smell too good. Espresso. All right, Kyle, you have 
Oh. Chipotle peppers. Oh, oh. Oh. Old sardine. Nutrient dense fish. Sardines are great for it. <laughs> and Alfredo sauce. <laughs> All right, put those in the blender. Oh, oh. God. <laughs> All that juice, you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. I'm getting some on This is Kaylee's favorite, bro. Alfredo and hot sauce, you know what I'm saying? Right. That's thick. Mm. One, two, go. One, two, three, stop. Oh, my. What? Oh, oh. My. <laughs> Wow. All right, how you feeling? Uh, I'm feeling Ooh. worried. How are you worried? You burnt your tongue this morning. Ain't no Chunky. Kyle, are you ready? Yes, sir. Three, two, one, go. FTG, let's go. Pound it. Pound it. Pound it. Let's go, Figgy. He's Come going. On. Don't even think about there it. You it's go. protein. Let's liver. go. Let's go. It's with good. protein, swallow it. Mine had chunks of sardines, and it was thick and nasty. Let's go, swallow that. Taste those Let's chunks, go. that is fish, mm -hmm. guys. Are you chewing? Oh, yeah, it's chunky. Chewing was the hardest part, but I didn't really taste it, so I think that stopped my gag reflexes. <laughs> oh, nope. Uh, Come on. Oh, go. Go. Almost done, bro. Let's problem. go. Last set, best set right here. Let's go. Let's go, baby. <sighs> you did it. He got it. All right, Joe, it's on you. Baby. Jump. Time is ticking. Let's go. Jump. 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 Let's go. Damn, Time. Jump. Was that, did that taste good, Joe? Tastes like ass. <laughs> Damn! Go for the chunky, John. Wait a second. Do I hear Kevin rooting on John right now? John's been doing good. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, please. I'll help you out later after this. I'll get all of theirs. Please? No. Oh. Oh. I love you. I don't even know what mayo kraut is, but Madison, this one's for you. Mayo kraut. Mayonnaise and sauerkraut. That's the chunkiest one of them all. Oh, man, that looks terrible. The way they were taking the cups before, they didn't seem like they got them down that easily. Oh, yeah, that should be interesting. Mm. There you go. Oh. There you go. There's got to be something else in that, because as soon as it hits the back of your throat, you're done for. Yeah, you're good, you're good, you're good. <laughs> I literally can't do it. Imagine it's like Christmas eggnog. That is the worst thing I've ever tasted in my life. I wish I could relate, but I can't. In fact, I'm gonna go get some champagne while y'all are taking so long. <laughs> oh my God. It's my kind of party. I don't even know how to explain that flavor. I believe in you. All of the people here actually believe in you. There you go, take a breather, take a breather. Hey, you're good, you're good, you're good. You can't swallow, swallow it. it. Swallow it, swallow it. <laughs> I literally can't do it. You can do it. There you go, there you go, there you go, there you go, there you go. Keep going, keep going. Yeah, good, good. job. There we go. Good job. You good? I don't want to go home. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going. You got it, girl. Drink it. You good? Ooh. It is. Uh, it is. Uh, Man. There's no way. Party over. The two teams that do this the fastest are moving on to the final fear. The one team that does it the slowest, unfortunately, is going home. Cynthia and Aubrey, because you won the last challenge, your fear advantage is that you get to remove one bar before you start. Okay. And by random selection, Ty and Corey, y'all are gonna have to go first. Yeah, you know, they wanna see the best first. This is extremely dangerous. And we have safety on standby because we don't want anyone to drown. Do you guys all understand? Yeah. Yes. Ty and Corey, let's get you in the box. Let's do it. I'm definitely a little freaked out. So be scared of drowning and then to be trapped in the water is definitely gonna be a challenge. Oh boy. Mind over matter. The poles were really tight on my neck, on my chest. I was definitely freaking out. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, trust me, trust me, trust me, trust me. All right, start the water. The water is rising, feel it. It's coming for you. Laying in the box with the water coming in your face, the water over your neck. I started hyperventilating because my biggest fear is to drown. It felt like I was in a cage. It was keeping me down. I couldn't lift my head up. I couldn't breathe. Three, two, one, go! That's one pole. 
Got two poles. Three poles. Oh! Doesn't go that way. It goes the other way. Get him out. That water's filling up. We had the chance to watch Ty and Corey, and we were just picking up little things that we could do a little bit better. Be careful. Hurry up. That's one. Two. Ty. $50,000. There you go. I went in there terrified. Holy Holding your breath underwater. That's honestly like I'm already scared thinking about it. Just like a jacuzzi. Just like a jacuzzi. It's all in the mind. I see you guys are holding each other's hands. Let's hope that this friendship lasts through what's about to happen. Water is rising. The first bar we want to get are the ones that are neck and our stomach and the ones closest to us. Three, two, one, go! We thought that each working on a single pole would be faster than doing it together. Oh, they're having troubles, having problems. We definitely got stuck. Yeah, we couldn't Chaos. keep track anymore. Hurry up, you gotta get out. There you go. Get that flag. How's it feel? Talk to me, Andrew. That was scarier than I thought it would be, but it was good. I was freezing, but we got through it, and I'm glad that I got to do it with my best friend. Yeah, and holding hands definitely helped calm my nerves like yes. while we were yes. in there. <laughs> the confined spaces was definitely the kicker for me. It was just so terrifying when I tried to move a certain way and there was something in my way. Cynthia and Aubrey, you guys got the fear advantage from the last challenge. You gotta let me know which pole you guys want to remove. The one on our let's, stomach, please. Let's go with the tummy one right here. Gotcha. That's the easiest one. <laughs> we decided on the stomach bar because we couldn't breathe. Like, it was completely on us. We figured we'll get that out of the way and the rest should be a little bit easier. <laughs> Are you like All right, you earned it. Now you better make it work to your advantage. Are you guys ready to face your fear? Yes. Yes. You need to beat a time of 54 seconds. Start the water. Nice and cold. As soon as that water hit us, it went up my nose immediately. And the first thing you think is, oh my god, I'm going to drown right now. You're feeling like you're beginning to drown. Three, two, one, go! Whoa, they on the move, they on the move. I'm scared of drowning, I'm scared of being stuck and unable to move. All of a sudden, I can't think. I saw her hustling, I saw her moving things, and that shocked me back into reality, like I need to get things out of the way. Aubrey is all twisted, she might get stuck. Ha! That challenge was honestly a double whammy for me because I'm scared of enclosed spaces and I'm scared of drowning and it was a little bit of both. The one thing I love about being the host is how close things come oh. and this one came extremely oh. close. Andrea and Bina, oh. Cynthia and Aubrey. Oh. The time to beat was 54 seconds. This competition between the two teams right here standing in front of me was within one second. Oh. Cynthia and Aubrey, your time was 53 seconds. That means you guys are moving on to the final fear. Bina and Andrea, I am extremely proud of you guys. Good job, you guys. Good job. Good job. Here is how it's gonna go down. One of you is going to stand on this platform above the water. You will be tied to a 300 pound anchor. I'm going to pull this lever. It will plunge you and that anchor deep down into that water. Your partner will have to swim to you. Untie the three knots before your lungs run out of breath. And 
then they're gonna take those scissors and then cut the rope. The person that gets freed has to swim over to this buoy to grab the flag. I was just trying to kind of mentally get prepared to stay under there and like fill my lungs with as much oxygen as I could really. Each team will do this two times. The team with the best single time goes home today with 50 grand. Get me out here, baby. Here comes your first attempt. Three, two, one. She has to untie three knots, then cut her partner free. Her partner then has to swim to the flag and time will stop. This challenge is very dangerous. So we have safety divers in the water. One rope is off. These girls definitely got some lungs on them. I love to breathe, you know you want to. You gotta breathe. I was already cold, like shooken up. My teeth were like chattering. My breath was just completely messed up. I wasn't relaxed. Two ropes are off. Third knot, she's got the third knot. Oh, <laughs> oh are you worried? Jasmine is having trouble cutting that rope. Oh, Carmela took off, but the rope isn't cut yet. She can't reach the surface. Jasmine is having trouble cutting that rope. She's free. Oh, she's swimming, she's swimming. Okay, Carmela Jazz, 56 seconds. Yeah, baby! I felt really comfortable and relaxed holding my breath. We put our best foot forward to put some pressure on the guys. Do you think you can beat their first attempt? Yeah, of course we can. Do you I know, know, you, can, can, you, know you can beat it? Oh, for sure. Yeah. Pressure is on, though. Let's, Let's go. Let's do this. Right. Give me some, give me some. Uh, hey! Uh, 56 seconds, talk to me. I was just a little confused when I couldn't like, yeah. get up for my air. But yeah. if you can't stay calm under there, it's yeah. over. Because right right when I felt myself like lose ease whenever I was coming up, that's when you start to not be able to breathe. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> Boom, air's down. I believe my partner is the me. I know you'd get a knot untied faster than I would, so you got this. He threw the first knot. This is gonna be close. He threw the second knot. And the third. He's swimming towards the flag. He's not even free yet. That's a good strategy, that's a good strategy. Aaron still has to cut the rope. 50 thou on the line. Aaron is struggling to cut that rope. Their lungs gotta be burning right now. Aaron got the rope cut. Lewis is free. Lewis is swimming with all these guys. How you guys feeling? What do you I think? Know, they did it pretty quick. Yeah. As soon as Aaron gets that third knot, I'm already booking it to that thing. So I've got like tension on the rope, so I can just cut through it real quick and he can already be on his way over there. You got one shoe on right now. You got now, one so shoe on. Going kind of crazy. That's all, that's all I'm trying to swim. But. Obviously, you guys know Carmela and Jasmine, 56 seconds. You guys did it in 36 seconds. Yeah, baby, yeah. Hold on a second. Hey, 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 don't celebrate yet. Sorry, go ahead. I know you're yes, asking. you are in pole position to win Fear Factor. However, Carmel and Jasmine still have another chance. Y'all are celebrating entirely Man. too early. Three, two, one, go! Like, I had been through the experience, so I knew it was probably not going to be the easiest time for her. First knot's out. Watching her struggle. I was having a hard time holding my breath as well. Second knot's out. Third knot. She's got the third knot. She's not free yet. She's not free yet. 25 seconds. Oh, no. She's coming up for water. No, no. Cut 
the road. And it's over. They did not beat your 36 right, seconds. let's go! You guys just won 15,000. Let's go! This is heads up. Here's how it's going to go down. Teammates will put their heads inside this box. When the clock starts, water will start to fill this box. It is your job to drink this water before it covers your nose and your mouth to where you cannot breathe. Oh, man. The clock will stop when one of you taps out and drains the water out of this box. Team with the shortest time lose their shot at winning $50,000. Fear of confined spaces, a fear of water. You put two of those together, nobody wants that. But that's not all. Inside, it will be something very special to you, which you're probably going to fear more than drowning. One randomly selected member of each team will hand over their cell phone, and I'm putting them in this box with you. <laughs> oh my God. Whenever she's like nervous about something, I become the one that's like not nervous. You got this, all right? Close your eyes and think about what you can do with the money. But also, once I was in the tank, I was kind of like, oh, this is scarier than it looked. Three, two, one, go. Starting the clock. When the hose started running, I was so freaking out. But I kept hearing Hannah like, oh, you got this, Shetty. Just happy thoughts. Think about the money. You're okay, you're okay, yeah. Oh, that's fast, bro. It's a big ass water fountain, that's all it is. There's your phone, 50 G's on the phone. I felt pretty confident about it because we practiced for this, you know, so we're good. But I rely on my phone every single day. What am I gonna do without my phone? <laughs> Hannah, I think your mom is calling you right now, though. Hey. I'll just tell her you're busy. Don't worry about it, I got you. Oh! Oh! My phone was completely submerged in the water. Don't worry about your phone floating in the water right now. But I still had to like act like I was fine and brave for her, you know? You're OK. Breathe. 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 What are you going to do with the money? Make more money. Remember, at any moment, if you're ready to tap out, pull that fear factor flag. Take your last breath. Hold your breath. <laughs> They've not given up yet. No giving up. Nice. She's about to see how she's about to tap. Bullets. my body having a seizure or something <laughs> in the water, but I was like, okay, I'm not gonna pull this flag. I'm not gonna pull it. All right, Jenny and Hannah, you had a time of three minutes and 24 seconds. All right. Money bags, that's nice. 324. All right, that's a good mark to beat. Up next, Daniel and Akel. Money, money, money. Our strategy is to drink water periodically. Just take a few sips, breathe, burp. Take a few sips, breathe, burp. Let's land that old gives us a beautiful baby boy. Are we ready? Let's go. Three. Let's go. I got you. two. I got you. One. I got you. Go. Money, 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 money. All right. No way to go but down. And the water is coming for you. You may not have to worry about your phone, but you still got to worry about the water. It's rising because they haven't been drinking that much. We were drinking like crazy. I was just gulping down as much water as I could in the beginning. I think that was the most important thing. You try it? I'm going to drink right now. It's like taking a bath. Watching the other contestants, there's so much anxiousness and anticipation. I was just kind of like scared. Minute and a half. It's coming for you. I ain't drinking no more. The higher the water rose, definitely made me more nervous because I couldn't drink any more water. I was more focused on when am I going to take my last breath. 215, y'all got a long time to be. You're not going to be able to hold your breath for more than 30 seconds. Any last words to your best friend before you guys drown? I got you, boy. That water's not going to stop till you give up. Face your fear, guys. Face your fear. Face it. Face it. Face it. Going under. Hold your breath. Uh-oh. How long can they hold their breath? He's already freaking out. I was running out of breath quick. I was trying to hold it. We had a death grip underneath the table. And you know, definitely. if I didn't feel that grip anymore, it was time to pull that lever. Come on, don't panic, don't panic. 
You know, I was running out of breath quick. I was trying to hold it, and then I had to pull that lever fast. Hannah and Jenny, you got time to beat with three minutes and 24 seconds. Akel and Daniel, you got a time of three minutes and 18 seconds. <laughs> we definitely underestimated Hannah and Jenny. We not top dogs no more. We, we got a ways to go. That means Jenny and Hannah, you guys are definitely going to the final fear. And that means my man Daniel and Akel, you guys are on the bubble. Jerry and Brent, you guys turn, so come on up. Aside from the fact that I'm going to be close to drowning, I am also gonna lose my phone. I'm more afraid of drowning than losing my phone, but both of them adds a lot of pressure to me. Any last words to Brent, Jerry? I love you. I love you too, Jay. Let's go. Hey, that's nice. Mm -hmm. Sure you guys are just friends? Yes, we are. We're just friends. 50K and your phones are on the line. It is time to face your fear. Are you ready? Yes, yes. I'm ready. Let's go. <laughs> All right, on my go. Three, two, one, go. Y'all look extra thirsty right now. Extra thirsty. Breathe, breathe. A big part of our strategy was to make sure that we don't let the water get too far up. That way we don't accidentally choke on the water and we can take a big enough breath to hold our breath underwater longer. Now, Kale, how you feeling right now? This is pressure right here, right? Let's hope this man relives yeah. his traumatic experience. I feel like I'm waiting for the results of a pregnancy test. You know what I'm saying? All right, Jerry, this is your worst nightmare. This is where you face your fear. You got this, guys. Oh, damn, there goes your phone. Phone is gone. Hold on. Relax, guys. 2.30. Think about the money. Oh, yeah. No, don't think about the money. Think about the water. Think about your life. You got this, guy. Your worst fear is about to happen. The water's about to overtake you. Just relax, guys. Hey, don't call. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. There you oh, go. Don't call. Uh -oh. There's no challenge issue. No challenge issue. You can do it. Three minutes. Just pull it. Oh, oh Jerry, come on, buddy. Oh, oh, he, oh, he, he gotta go. There it is, there it is. Stay calm. Now, you sure he's still in there? Oh, oh. <laughs> Jerry, you did that. You face your fear, man. Great. I'm so proud of you. As the water was rising, I saw the whole flashback. Like I saw the hair, I saw everything. And like, oh, it was just like, I literally was gonna give up like four times. But what made me push through was the fact that I knew that Brynn was also going through it. Fifty thousand dollars is on the line here. Akel and Daniel, Jerry and Brynn, your times were within three seconds of each other. Akel uh -huh. and Daniel, your time was 318. Bryn and Jerry, your time was three minutes and 15 seconds. Whoa! Whoa! No. No on that. I call this challenge teabagging. Huh. from the helicopter 100 or so feet above the cold, murky water. The helicopter will violently dump you in and out of the water, making it extremely hard for you to unscrew those eight giant wing nuts that are holding the cage door closed. Transfer them to that box. Once the door opens, the two of you will jump out. Stopping the clock. Like, whose job is it to with us like this? <laughs> the team that does this the fastest We'll have an extra $50,000 to go home to. Yes sir. yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. While the other two will lose sleep for the next two weeks because they came this damn close to winning $50,000. Oh, when the helicopter first brought us above ground, like over the water, that's when I was starting to get anxious because we are attached to a helicopter and it is swinging from left to right. They are hanging on tight. Great. Lexi's going high. Our 
our strategy was, since I'm a little bit taller, that I was going to start at the top and she was going to start at the bottom and work her way up. Being drunk in the water, it is nerve-wracking. You don't know when you're about to come up. We're going under. Hold it. Hold it. The dunk was scary to me because my head was hitting the top of the cage and the water was very cold. Hold the gun. Hold the gun. Hold the gun. Got the first wing nut. Seven more to go. You want to be careful not to drop any of the wing nuts. Okay, okay. Okay, I got another one. There you go. All right, I got three. We'd get really flustered when we were underwater, so it would just be a best idea to stay calm and focus on not inhaling all of the water. It's tough to look cute underwater. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Challenge. You will be facing the fear of drowning. Drowning? Well, actually, more like upside down. Upside down? Oh, no. <laughs> I'm freaking out. I'm super scared. Drowning is not cool. I call this next challenge Upside Drown. Water will rush into this tank. Once the water passes your nose, the clock will start. One of your hands will be holding the rope at the bottom of the tank. The other will be holding a flag. If you let go of the flag or the rope, the clock will stop and you will be saved. The team that spends the least amount of time in this tank will be sent home. And the other two teams will advance to the final challenge, bringing them one step closer to $50,000 for their favorite charity. Make sure you grab hold of that rope. All right, start the water. I'm not gonna drown you. Okay? 
Time will start when the water hits their nose. It was ice cold. Immediately makes me short of breath. I mean, your body just kind of freezes for a second. All right, the clock is starting. What do you think about that? It's okay. Keep breathing. Looks like Zach is underwater. He's already holding his breath. Cody's still got his mouth above water. Panic. He's panicking. He's still not under yet. Water is rising fast. Zach is starting to struggle a little bit. I can't do this. Zach's really freaking out. I'm really terrified. I mean, this is like fear factor on a whole nother level. Good job, guys. Good job. Not fun. I'm happy that we're out. You were like Aquaman. I was like Aquaman. But that was scary. I think that was way scarier than the first one. Oh. Here we go. I was scared. Start the water. 53 seconds is the time to beat to not go home. Uh-oh. I don't know if it was the grease on my nose, but the nose plug fell off. The anxiety starts to kick in. Don't worry about your nose peaks. Just worry about holding your breath. Don't drop that flag. Hear it? Yep. Time starts now. Uh-oh. Oh, oh. Water running up his nose. No I, chance. And he was like blowing bubbles out of his mouth. Can we get this guy out of the water? Caleb's starting to struggle a little bit. Oh, he's shaking. He's going to push himself to his dream. And we're out. We better than beat that one. I tried to do what I learned in scuba school, to blow pee bubbles out of your mouth as slow and as long as you can. And then I literally couldn't hold it no more. I'm really scared. <laughs> You're fine. That was tough, that was tough. Blake, how scary out. was that for you? Did you see your brother struggling a little bit? Nah, man, I just got yanked out of the water. <laughs> Disappointed. All right, well, the time to beat was 53 seconds. You guys got a time of 33 seconds. Dang it. Which means, Zach and Cody, you guys are 100% moving on to the final fear. <laughs> and so, Blake, Caleb, you're on the bubble. It just depends on what Rachel and Brendan do. You just have to relax. Come on, stop. You need to at least try, all right? Rachel, I can see you're upset right now. You up for doing this? I'm gonna do it. Yes. You can definitely do this. I'm gonna do it. Gonna do it. All right, all right making sure, just making sure. All right, you can do this. I'm the only girl here, and these guys probably have bigger lungs and better lung capacity than I do. Lower them down. I'm literally freaking out right now. I don't know if I can do this. Drop a volume to YouTube, okay? All right. Fill the water. You hear the water filling up. You can feel it. Every single one of your senses is telling you to get the H out of there. The clock is starting. Rachel was crying earlier, but she seems confident now. All we can do is wait. Oh, this is going to be close. And they're out. Good job, y'all. Good job. Great job. You did it. Good Rachel, you survived. Woo! Overcoming that fear, I was so proud of myself that I could just do it. Good job, Rachel. Congratulations for conquering your fears. A lot of crying before you went, but as soon as you got in that tank, you were real calm. I went to my happy competition place. Oh, wow. Yeah, so I have to, like, get in that zen mind frame. The husband gets you there? Most of the time, I can get her there. Even when I'm freaked out, Brendan's always here to let me know that I've got this. 33 seconds is the time to beat by Caleb and Blake. Rachel and Brendan, you guys got a time of 50 seconds. <laughs> You are 100% moving on. Oh! All right. Caleb and Blake, I'm sorry. I got to send you home. This is Flash Flood. One of you will be inside the trunk of this car. What? what? The other will be strapped in the driver's seat. Then I will sink this car. In the back seat are a bunch of keys, but only one will open the trunk and release your partner. 
As the water violently rushes into the car, the person in the front of the car must grab a key one at a time and swim to the trunk to release your partner. Here's the thing. If it's the wrong key, you gotta go back until you find the right one. <laughs> Once you get the flag from the partner in the trunk, you swim to that buoy stopping time. Whichever team does this the fastest, win 50 Gs. Whichever team does this the slowest, it's going home. This challenge is very dangerous, so we have safety divers in the water. This is serious business. So by random selection, Sophia and Summer, you guys are going up first. Stay calm and stay focused and try to think of a strategy to go as fast as I can. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Women versus the men. Let's go. Three, two, one, go. All right, here we go. All right, Daquan Cooper, the time to beat is one minute, two seconds. Small spaces and he doesn't like water at all. All right, he's got the second key. He's going for it. How you feeling, ladies? Nervous. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Second key does not work. 30 seconds down. Come on, 30 seconds. Throw it away. Going for the third key. Uh oh, he's struggling a little bit. He's got to catch his breath. He's trying to come up for air. Come on, Cooper. Come on, Cooper. Let's go. That's down to the wire. Hey, let's pull a lot of water in, bro. All right, come on. Uh, I didn't expect the water pressure to be like that, and I came up for air too much. And, I mean, we tried our best, so. I want to win. I just, I like to win. 
All right, talk to me. What's going on in your head, man? You seem a little disappointed, but I'm telling you, I'm sure it was close. Daquan, yeah. what's going on in your head? I was on now. I was on now. Get over it. All right. The time to beat was one minute and two seconds by Sophia and Summer. Daquan and Cooper, you guys got a time of one minute. <laughs> 25 seconds, which means Sophia and Summer, you just won $50,000. I call this last challenge corkscrewed. You will be suspended on that giant corkscrew, dangling over this tank of water with your feet locked to the bottom rung. Oh, no. Now, on my go, you and your partner strategically have to make your way up the corkscrew as it gets lowered into the water. Now, since this stunt is so dangerous, there will be rescue divers close by. Unless you are a fan of drowning, I suggest you move quick. Once you reach the top, you both need to grab those flags to stop the clock. Now, the team with the fastest time is gonna stop at the bank on the way home to deposit $50,000. Yes, yes, sir. And the losing team will have one more thing to blame each other for. All right, the corkscrew is lowered into the water on my go. Three, two, one, go. Ow, wait, let me go first. Don't, don't get stuck. Don't get stuck on my, don't get stuck on my. They're already sliding. As soon as the water got to my feet, it was a little heavier to pull myself in. I started freaking out a little bit. The corkscrew is getting lower and lower in the water. It doesn't look like they're moving fast mm -hmm. enough to me. Hurry up. Freaking out, I didn't want to get into the water. As soon as the water got in my nose, I got really scared. Yeah, it's going under. They about to drown right here. Ooh. Okay. Looks like Tim's height seems to be an advantage here. Get up. Go. Go, Jess. Go, Jess. They're almost to the top. They each need to grab one flag. Come on. Let's go. We're almost there. We're almost there. Let me pull a closer one. Hmm. That seemed pretty intense. Yeah. Oh, my God. Let that be the fastest time. All right, time to beat is one minute, eight seconds. Three, two, one, go. Don't go. Don't go yet. He did not say go. <laughs> Lift your legs, lift your legs, lift your legs. Knee up, knee up. Think it fast now. When we were under the water more, I was literally floating. I don't know how, but I was just started going with the screw, and it made it easier. Wait, wait, she is way ahead of him right oh, now. Man. Focus, focus. Hey, Nick, you about to drown. No. When I was underwater, I was thinking I was definitely about to drown, but I just had to go as fast as possible, hoping that I keep my head above water. We got it. This is going to be close. Oh, we tried to reach the water. You couldn't oh, get it. Grab it. Grab it. We already won. Oh, just get up. up. Man, it's gonna be too close for comfort, bro. I think we beat. I don't know. This is gonna be close. We had to do it. We had to do it. The time to beat from Jazz and Tim was one minute and eight seconds for fifty thousand dollars. Nick and Ashley, you guys got a time of one minute. In six seconds, yeah! you just won fifty thousand dollars. Ah! Let's go! So let me share with everybody a little fun fact. You can survive eight days without water. 
However, if you are tied up and submerged underwater, <laughs> you'd only survive maybe about, I don't know, four minutes or so. I call this next challenge, Last Breath. The two of you will be locked in that tank as it fills with water. One of you will be shackled to the bottom while the other is tied to the top. The person up high will have to coach their teammate to finish a puzzle on a tablet that is over their heads. Once completed, it will reveal a code that will be used to free the bottom person's lock. With one of you free, you will race against the rising water to find the key to unlock your teammate who hangs helplessly. <laughs> the clock stops when you are both free. The three teams that do this the fastest are one step closer to $50,000. The one team that does it the slowest, they're gonna have a wet ride home, and you know how that goes, right? Yep. By random selection, Hannah and Haley, you guys are going oh. first. Oh. Going into this first challenge, I don't really like confined spaces. We are definitely nervous. That fear is set in that you could drown. All right, start the water. Are you ready? Yeah! Three, two, one, go! Okay, right, right, on the touch Yeah! Right! Right! Touch right! Over to the right, right, right. Straight over, straight over to the left. It was scary having to direct Hannah so she could unlock that code and free herself. The water was rising and rising and rising. Like, it started to freak me out. It's scary, and that water was cold. No, stop. Go a little bit more down. One wrong move on that tablet, it will reset. And the water is rapidly rising. The water's cold, right? Freezing. Anna was shivering. And I'm like, oh, gosh, she's not going to make it through this. I felt really nervous. What's about to happen? What are we getting ourselves into? Now go straight down, straight down, straight down. Three, nine, five, one, go. OK, they got the code. They got the pattern. I didn't even realize she had the code until she started screaming numbers. Now she just has to unlock those locks. I felt kind of helpless. Like, my hands are just behind her back. Like, she's the one that has to unlock herself and then come and unlock me. Ah, uh, it's taking too long. You're good. Stand up, stand up. Get that key, get that key. Uh-oh, she got the lock. Get that key, get the key. Let's go. Now she's got the key. She's making good time so far. Get that key in. You got to unlock Haley. Oh. And time. I'm proud of you. Thank you. That was pretty damn good. Fill the tank. But it's a little anxiety. I'm having a little anxiety about this. Three, two, one, go! Slow down, down. No, 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 no. Come out of the room. Slow down. Slow down. No, don't touch this girl. Slow down. Don't touch this girl. Left, you're wrong. No, 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 no. Push your hand away. Down, down, down. Go diagonally. That water is rising really fast. I'm kind of freaking out because it's cold water, freaking freezing. Up, 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 diagonal, right. Up, up, diagonal, diagonal, diagonal. Now one wrong move, and they're going to have to start all over again. I'm same getting in vocal training, but man, the water is rising. I don't have that much time. Every second counts, so I'm like, oh my god, I have to get this lock through. Come on, babe. You got this. It is impressive, though. He hasn't come up for air yet. All right, he's got it. Come on. Oh, he doesn't have it. What is happening? You have the numbers. Why isn't it going through? My whole body is going to be underwater, so I'm just hoping my husband is coming to save me. He doesn't want to be responsible for letting his wife drown. Come on, babe. Come on. Come on. He's got it. All right, he's looking for the key now. Open your eyes. I don't know why he's swimming. He should be floating. Open your eyes. Open your eyes. All right, he's got the key. Come on, come on. Open your eyes. Hey, Mike, how you feel? You know, it is what it is. We didn't We quit. still feel we pretty quit. good. OK. The time to beat was 1 minute, 11 seconds by Haley and Hannah. Shay and Mike, you guys got a time of 2 minutes, 39 seconds, which means, Haley and Hannah, you are 100% moving on to the next oh, yeah. challenge. Oh, that man. puts you on the bubble, Mike and Shay. It just depends on what everybody else here does. All right. Being the tank for the first time, I don't really like tight spaces. You know, we're both wide-bodied guys. You get a little bit of heart beating. <laughs> 
gotta do what you gotta do, huh? All right, start the water. All right, the time to beat is two minutes and 39 seconds. Are you guys ready? Yep. Three, two, one, go! All right, bottom middle, right there, bottom middle. Bottom, over, over to your left, right there, right across. Okay, down, 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 down. Up, up, up to your right, keep going. Now left, left, left. Straight. That water is rising fast. Up to your right. You know, when I'm in the tank, he's trying to direct me, and then, like, the water's coming up, so I'm like, oh, man, I gotta hurry up. Straight up, straight up. Six, one, three, nine. Going for the key, he's going for it. Oh, he keeps stumbling a little bit. Come on, boy, go! And time! I don't know, that was close. How do you guys think you did? We did cool. All right, well, the time to beat. Two minutes and 39 seconds. Kyrie and Edge, you guys got a time of. One minute, 21 seconds, which okay, means you're 100% moving yeah. on. Yeah, that yeah. puts you on the bubble still, Mike and Shay. It all depends on what Miranda and Alana are going to do. Time to be two minutes, 39 seconds. Are you ready? Ready! Three, two, one, go! Uh-oh, she's having a little trouble here in her sister's directions. Extra loud right now. I was so confused. Miranda was all over the place. It just didn't seem like she was following the strategy that we planned. I could just feel the water rising. That started to freak me out. The water is to her shoulders. Uh oh, water's rising. And like I was stressing a little bit. because Miranda's almost underwater, trying to get those locks. This is gonna be close. You can quit! Good. All right, she's got the lock. Now she gotta get the key. She got the key, she's gonna be really close. And she's got the key and... Oh, time! All right, it was so close that there was a difference of 10 seconds between you. Oh my God. Shay and Mike, you guys had a time of two minutes, 39 seconds. Miranda, Alana, you guys got a time of two minutes, 29 seconds. <laughs>